Well, it took three car trips and an airplane ride to get six newborn puppies and their parents to a new rescued life here in the Triangle. I can hear the awes yes. that are going to happen as you watch <laughs> this story all over the place. The family came from an overcrowded shelter in far western North Carolina. CBS 17's Maggie Newland has a look at their incredible journey. These little puppies have traveled more in their eight days than some dogs ever do. They came from Cherokee. They were born at a rural shelter in the far western corner of North Carolina, which, like so many other animal rescue facilities across the country, is already full. The shelters are packed. Staff reached out to Triangle Beagle Rescue, some 360 miles away, to find a foster home for the puppies and their mom and dad. It became a, a family trip to the Triangle area. And it was quite the journey across the state. The shelter manager at Valley River Humane Society in Marble, North Carolina, first drove the Beagle family 70 miles east to Waynesville. Another volunteer drove them 100 miles to Hickory, where a pilot flew them to RDU. A final drive to Nightdale brought them to their foster home. The people keep rising to the occasion. Leanne Tenbush with Triangle Beagle Rescue, who drove that last leg of the trip, says it's heartwarming to see so many people step up to help this little family, especially when so many shelters and rescues are overwhelmed. Rescue workers are tired. And we all know inflation is crazy. People are having to make difficult decisions about their dogs because they can't feed them or give them vet care. So all these volunteers banding together to kind of get them when there are open spots and rescues it's amazing she says the pilot involved in the rescue volunteers with pilots and paws a nonprofit that provides free flights to rescued animals these newborns were able to have their first flight it was awesome but it's only the beginning of their journey when they're old enough the puppies along with their mom meredith and dad gibson will be ready for new homes and families and even more adventures once they're adopted. Maggie Newland, CBS 17 News. How cute are they? Uh, so sweet. So